We made it to Mississippi. So a lot of y'all might be wondering, Andrew, why are you doing the intro, right? You don't want to see me do the intro. You want to see Jenna doing the intro. You have to stick with me doing the intro because Jenna bought a new car and Jenna is driving said new car because <laughs> this is a seven and a half hour drive and Jenna wanted to get some experience driving it for the first time and what better way to do it than to drive to Mississippi. So I'm really excited to be going to Mississippi because we're actually gonna see my good friend Alexis get married tomorrow. So if you saw our dress clothes in the back here, I'm really excited, never been to Mississippi and stopped in Mississippi, only driven through. So we'll take the time to explore Laurel, which also is the place where Hometown on HGTV is filmed. So gonna maybe do some tours, see some cool houses, and explore this new town and state. So on the way to Mississippi, we did want to stop at a little bit of a midway point to make sure we got some food in us. So we stopped in Baton Rouge and ate at a place called Bellews. We, we didn't really expect to film in here. We were just stopping obviously to eat, but it was one of the best restaurants that I've been to. And the experience was awesome. Would not trade it for a thing. Might have been the peak of our trip and we just got started, so I don't know yet. <laughs> yeah, it was, it was absolutely amazing. The owner, his name was Blue. He came to our table and immediately brought out samples uh, of the food there. We chatted with him and then he was like, well, if you want to, we can, I can give you a little tour of the place. So he gave us a full tour of the property, and the kitchen. the kitchen. He even uh, bought like a welding shop next door back in the 60s. And he's got a bunch of stuff in the back on the property. Um, he showed us all a lot of his projects that he had back there. So many fun things. Uh, a sign that he made, a swing that he made. Like it was so cool. It was so unique. Things that I had never seen before. But it was amazing. Um, we had so much fun. Also, he said if we ever returned, he would give us a cooking lesson. So might have to go back someday. Time to make a run for it. We made it! located a little outside of Floral, Mississippi. As you may know, we love to stay at Airbnbs when we travel, and there were only a few available in Laurel, Mississippi, probably because of my friend's wedding and all the people coming in town, but we happened to grab this one a few months back. So this is the house. I think the owner of this Airbnb loves to travel because throughout this house, there's a bunch of travel decorations and maps, and it just, so many interesting books. So I will show you around. This is the living room, nice open space. Look at all these books she has. I'm looking forward to going through some of these and seeing what her collection consists of. But the coolest thing is right here, there is a book on the coffee tables that's called I Live in Laurel. So I'm also gonna read this. It's a little children's book about the city. And into the beautiful kitchen, a lot of space, and we may try to cook this time. We will see, or we might just uh, do another frozen pizza, but we don't know yet. And then come through here. This beautiful blue bedroom is the one we chose that we're gonna stay in today. Nice and cozy and very blue. Okay, so the reason I really wanted this Airbnb is right through here. It's this backyard. Look at this view. I saw the pictures online and I was like, yes, I can totally see myself sitting here drinking coffee, reading a book. Just, oh, this view, this tree, the backyard. It is so beautiful. And then there's this whole other entire area, extra bathroom, bedroom, but we're probably not gonna be over in this area too much because it's a big house for two people. <laughs> and look, she stopped it with coffee, which is so important in an Airbnb. So we'll have a bunch of different coffees to choose from in the morning to drink on the porch. my hair 
gel. Well, I didn't forget my hair gel. I forgot to put my hair gel in. And now I feel like I look like a nerd. Our first stop is Bird Dog Cafe. delicious. Andrew loves cinnamon rolls, so of course we went with this one. There's also a sticky roll with pecans, looks to die for. And we bought some cookies for later. Mm. Okay, let's try it out. Oh my god. All right, cinnamon roll king, how is it? It's really good, really, really good. Soft bread, sticky cinnamon, and amazing icing. It's a perfect combination. need to walk off that cinnamon roll. It looks like there's a lot of construction going on downtown. I read an article that was written in 2016 talking about how Laurel's going through this whole transformation and they were redesigning their downtown and renovating their yeah. downtown to make it look nice and new and it's so cute and I'm guessing that's what's going on here. And the next hot spot on our list was Peddler's Junction, an antique and artisan shop located in downtown Laurel. This boutique has so much to offer, and in 2017, it was even voted as the town's number one best place to find a bargain. They even had a map where we were able to pin our hometown. Good morning! So I know with recording we left off and we were in the antique store and we didn't really do an outro, but after that, we went over and had some lunch and then got ready to go to my good friend Alexis and Justin's wedding. It was so beautiful. It was out in the country and there was a lot of dancing and it was just, it was such an awesome experience. Yeah, it was amazing. And today what we're gonna be doing is some things that we ended up not doing yesterday, including the world famous, apparently, hometown store, um, Laurel Mercantile Company. So we're really excited about that. And then we're also going to be going to, I believe, Lee's Coffee Shop um, and checking that out more today. But before we do, I'm going to give you a tour of my new car. Let's go! So this is my new car. She is a 2015 Subaru Forester that I happened to find at a really good price. I haven't named her yet, but I think it's gonna be Mariposa, like butterfly. But when I went to buy my car, I prayed for a sign to help me find which is the right car. And uh, the whole time I was in the negotiation room, there's a butterfly sitting on top of this car. So very special. She's very beautiful overall. There's gonna be so much storage for road trips. There's gonna be way better mileage than my Jeep Wrangler. And it's a better adventure car than Andrew's Mazda 3. So, and look, perfect rooftop crossbars. Be perfect for a rooftop tent, which will be coming soon. Very spacious, very clean. Overall, this is a very awesome used car that we were able to find. Hometown is an HDTV show starring Ben and Aaron Napier, a couple who works to restore beautiful southern homes in Laurel. This show premiered on January 24, 2016 and has since completed five seasons. 
So this store, Laurel Mercantile, is owned by Ben and Aaron, as well as four other friends and family members. This retail store full of American-made goods includes original apparel, candles, homeware, and beautiful art and woodwork. Even Aaron's signature headbands are sold here. Unfortunately, we never ran into Aaron and Ben during our visit, but at least we got to take a cool picture with their cardboard cutout. This shop was beautiful and unique and is the top tourist attraction in town. So our last stop is going to be Lee's Coffee and Tea. They sell food and lunch, but we're really just looking to try the coffee and maybe a pastry. We don't know yet. It's a cute little coffee shop in the center of town and it's been open for about 10 years and is family run. Let's go get a coffee. Look at this cute little table we found. We're on the second level, drinking our coffees. I give it a 10 for atmosphere. What do you rate the coffee? This one specifically, it's not good. <laughs> I know, I think I might have messed it up and asked for only one pump of hazelnut. We're not complaining though, we're still gonna drink it. <laughs> Smooth moves. Thank you. So one of the best things about visiting a small town is that things usually are closed on Sunday and you can pretty much do everything in one day. So we finished off everything that we wanted to do today and now we have the rest of the day to just relax and enjoy the Airbnb. Um, we're also watching a Netflix show, Back With Your Ex, so I'm pretty excited to watch that. Um, and overall, we're just gonna have a really Relax night and also try some ice cream made with oat milk. <laughs> well, if you've made it this far in the video, thank you so much for stopping by and watching our video. Leave a comment below so we know who to thank, um, and we really appreciate y'all's support. We'll see you in the next one. <laughs>